Now I know you are all bored of hearing about Manchester United and Ivan Perisic, but it is our main bit of transfer activity at the moment. We all want us to sign a defensive midfielder, but it seems that Jose Mourinho and Ed Woodward's focus is on the Croatian winger. Now he flew out to China as part of Inter Milan's squad for their pre-season tour, which means Man United failed to negotiate a deal before he flew out. But the latest update from Gianluca Di Marzio may suggest that it might not just be Manchester United who are digging their heels in over this transfer. Gianluca Di Marzio says that Inter Milan have rejected a bid for Perisic from Manchester United of 45 million euros plus 5 million euros in bonuses, which of course totals 50 million euros, which is their valuation of Perisic. But he goes on to say that Inter Milan are absolutely insistent that Anthony Martial be part of any deal which takes Perisic to Old Trafford. Goes on to say that Inter Milan have been in contact with Martial's representatives who have been open and welcome to the concept of Martial going to Inter Milan on loan, but that Man United have completely quashed it. Man United are not interested in letting Martial go anywhere. And earlier in this window, Martial pledged his, well at least his short term future to Manchester United. Said ignore the rumours, they're all false. I'm happy at Man United. And Inter Milan, the concept of Martial going anywhere this summer, let alone going to Inter Milan as part of a deal to see Perisic come to Man United, you may as well stop thinking that because there is absolutely no way that is going to happen. And by the looks of it, it isn't just Ed Woodward being a penny pincher trying to get the best deal for Perisic that has caused this transfer to drag on so much. If we're offering 45 million plus 5 million in bonuses, that's the price that Inter Milan want for the 28 year old. But they still don't want to agree on it because they want Martial to be part of the deal. There's, a, there's two reasons for that. Either Man United are not offering enough up front and Inter Milan would want the whole 50 million up front or nothing. Or alternatively, they want Martial. Or looking at the third option, they're just including Martial, knowing absolutely full well that Man United are not going to be willing to negotiate Martial to be part of it just to let this transfer drag on because they have no intention of ever going through with it. Now the concept of Martial going to Inter, as I said, Inter Milan jog on. There is no way that Martial, and first of all, Martial was worth more than Perisic on his own, let alone being part of any deal which sees Perisic come to Manchester United. And the whole reason that we need Perisic at Man United is to give us variety, strength in depth, balance in the squad and alternatives. If we were to then bring Perisic in and let Martial go, we find ourselves in the exact same situation, but instead of needing a player like Perisic, we need a player like Martial. Man United are back in the Champions League next year. We need strength in depth in every position. So there's no way that Martial is going to leave as part of any deal for Perisic. So if that truly is the case, Man United need to move on. Man United need to look elsewhere. Now the problem is, where do they look elsewhere? What alternatives are there in the market for Perisic? And I'm not talking about Alexis Sanchez or Gareth Bale. I'm talking about direct alternatives for Perisic. Players who are old school wingers. In the modern game, old school wingers don't really thrive that much because there aren't that many of them. But I'm talking traditional wingers whose natural instinct is to cut outside around the fullback and to whip across in. Wingers these days, they're inside forwards. They cut to the edge of the box. That's where they're dangerous. But... What alternatives are there in the market for Perisic? Direct alternatives. I want you to let me know in the comments below because I think we're going to do a video looking at potential alternatives for Perisic and I'll be interested to know which ones you think are potentially available in the current window. Um, but as far as Inter Milan and Perisic and Martial goes, it's either Inter Milan want the full 50 million up front and they won't want to accept the 45 plus 5 bonuses from Man United, which I think is a very, very fair and reasonable offer. If that has been the offer, which is the Gianluca Di Marzio saying it is, then it's not Man United's fault as far as I'm concerned. It's just Inter Milan just being greedy. But I don't know anymore. I really don't know whether Man United should keep going with Perisic. We've come this far. Do we stop now? Or if we don't go for Perisic, who do we go for? Let me know in the comments below what you think about this. But what is clear, otherwise, it's completely the opposite of clear, I suppose. But what we're looking at, it's either Man United not giving enough up front as part of that 45 million plus 5 million bonuses for Perisic and Inter Milan want a bit more. Or Inter Milan are just getting greedy and they, they feel that they want Martial as part of the deal. I don't know, I'm dead confused about this because 
Inter surely know. We're not letting Martial go anywhere. So why are they asking for him? I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments below. As always, drop a like on the video, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, subscribe if you're new down there or down there. We'll see you soon. Take it easy.